Today I'm super excited to talk about a tool that has been a game changer in how we manage and automate cloud infrastructure. Terraform. If you already know Terraform, let me know how you like it in the comments below. I'd love to hear your experience. Now, if you're new to Terraform or just curious to learn more about what it can do, you're in the right place. So let's get into it. So what is Terraform? In simple terms, Terraform is an open source infrastructure as code tool. It allows you to define cloud infrastructure like servers, databases, and networking using code. Instead of clicking around in the UI, creating resources manually, you will write just a script and Terraform does the heavy lifting then for you. Let's talk about the problems of Terraform solves, right? So imagine you're building a Azure based data pipeline. Without Terraform, you have to manually create services like data factories, signups, analytics, and storage accounts. This takes time, introduces inconsistencies, and can lead to errors, right? Because it's you that's doing it. Terraform changes the game. When you write your infrastructure as code, it's reusable and guarantees the same results every time you run it. Whether you're deploying your pipeline in a test environment or scaling it in production. You can trust that Terraform gives you exactly what you defined. So there are no really surprises. How does Terraform work? It's quite straightforward. You write in your infrastructure definitions in a simple configuration language called HCL or HashiCorp configuration language. Uh, if you worked with YAML before, you will find HCL very familiar. It's a human readable and easy to learn format. Once you've written your configuration, you use commands like Terraform plan to preview changes and Terraform apply to deploy them. Plus, it works seamlessly with other providers like AWS, GCP, Databricks, Snowflake, and so on and so on. So it's not just Azure. One of the most powerful features of Terraform is its ability to manage the lifecycle of your infrastructure. Using its state file, Terraform tracks every resource it's managing. You need to make changes, Terraform will update only what's necessary. Want to delete and recreate your entire infrastructure? Terraform can do that too. Just update the configuration or use commands like Terraform taint for specific resources. This flexibility is perfect for testing, disaster recovery, or scaling up your infrastructure. Now let's talk about collaboration. When your Terraform configurations are stored in a version control system like GitHub, teamwork becomes basically seamless. You and your colleagues can work together on the same infrastructure code, review changes through pull requests, and track the history of the modifications. And here's where it gets even better. Terraform integrates perfectly with GitHub Actions, enabling full CI-CD pipelines. This means you can automatically validate, test, and deploy your infrastructure changes as part of your development workflow. It's a complete solution for efficient automated infrastructure management. If you're wondering how to get started with Terraform, I've got something that might just be perfect for you. Over at my academy at learndataengineering.com, I've created a hands-on project called Azure Pipelines with Terraform. It's designed to guide you through building a real-world automated data pipeline on Azure, basically step by step. This hands-on training is all about real-world skills. You'll extract data from APIs, process it using Azure tools, and even implement architectures like the Lakehouse and Medallion architecture. By the end, you'll not only understand Terraform, but also have a complete project to showcase your skills. Plus, we'll dive into setting up CI CD pipelines using Terraform and GitHub, so your entire workflow from code to deployment is automated and efficient. Terraform uh, isn't just an automation, it's about helping you focus on what really matters, right? Solving problems, creating value. If you're ready to level up your skills, head over to learndataengineering.com and check out the hands-on project. Let's build something amazing. All right, so don't forget to like and subscribe if you found this helpful and don't forget to share your experience with Terraform in the comments. I'd love to hear how you're using it. Until next time.